In Bimini, Bahamas, a team of experts are hoping to entice a couple sharks for an experiment. And get more than they bargained for. They're testing if sharks can detect magnetic fields. The answer could unlock a major mystery about how sharks find far-flung food-rich volcanic islands, and whether the island's naturally magnetic lava rock is involved. For this open water experiment, they arrange three powerful magnets to the right and three non-magnetic controls to the left. A big hammerhead glides over the aluminum control without a glance and heads for the magnets. There was a magnet that went over, just kind of jerked its head a bit when it got close. Yeah, I definitely saw that reaction on that hammerhead. Okay, here we go with another one. Hammerheads ignore the aluminum, clustering around the magnets. The nurse sharks have a greater response. The nurse shark also felt over that magnet. We see a strong response by these nurse sharks in particular. Yeah, this one's trying to eat the magnet right now. Look at that. You would say eating counts as a strong response. Nurse sharks are drawn to the magnets. Oh, here we go. Absolutely swarmed by nurse sharks down here. As far as you can see, they're coming from every direction. Absolutely crazy melee of fences. You see, it's just biting and biting. Heads up, heads up. The sharks are agitated, possibly by the magnets. That was fantastic. That was great. So many hammerheads down there all over the place. A bunch of nurse sharks. Nurse sharks were biting at the magnets. Really neat dive all around. You know, so that dive was crazy. We had nine hammerheads there. You know, seemed like countless nurse sharks. What we saw was that both the nurse sharks and the hammerheads did respond to the magnets. So what we can take away from that is that those weak magnetic fields that are locked in volcanic rock are something that the sharks could detect and may be able to use in navigation.